What's up, everybody? Welcome to a Let's Play here on YouTube.com slash KindOfFunnyGames. I'm one of your hosts, Greg Miller, alongside the pure one, at Tim Geddes. Let's him host. Is it as good as you wanted it to be? You've been playing Mario Odyssey. It absolutely is yep. as good as I want it to be. Now, a couple a couple things I want to say. Yeah. First off, it is extremely, extremely hot here. So yeah. there's a fan on. So if you're wondering what that sound is, it's a fan. Also, you might wonder what these are. These are oh, what God. man's legs look like, good all right? Lord. When you wear right. shorts cool. the same as this guy. Cool. Thanks, Kevin. There's a big fan. You know what I'm a big fan of? Mario Odyssey, Greg. <laughs> That's how things work here. Now, the problem is... Uh, I had just beaten the game. Okay. Like the, the core game. You sure. know what I mean? Like I, I beat Bowser. Like that. Yeah, I, I got to the, 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 That's it. But you know, as you know, there's always a lot of post-game content in sure. these Mario games, especially the 3D Mario games. Um, you look back to Mario 64. It only takes, I think, 70 stars to beat the game, and then yeah, there's yeah. 120 total, and then there's all that stuff, right? Right. Same thing with Sunshine. There's always here. There's a lot. A lot of moons. There's a, there's a, there's a ton of moons. Okay. Numbers numbers have it at something close to eight nine hundred. Moons. Okay. All right. Yeah. That's a damn lot of moons. I don't. By my count, I think I have 180 something, mm -hmm. 160 something. I don't know. Somewhere I have a lot. Okay. But that, that's what I needed to get there. But the problem is, there's a lot of spoilery stuff here. Mm -hmm. So if you do not want to be spoiled in this game and just want to go in completely clean, I just fell asleep there. Uh, do not watch this. Come back and watch it later. Because the thing is, Greg. Yeah. The best thing this game does is keep you. Surprised. Surprising. Everywhere you, every corner you turn, there's something that makes you go, huh. Dry bones? Huh. I, I mean, hey, I don't want to tell you. Big dry bones in this game? I think it's an easy, easy, easy yes. But yeah, okay. uh, there, there's just so much stuff. When, when we first saw the E3 trailer, there was the big Tyrannosaurus Rex, right? Sure. There was a question of like, all right, cool, that's kind of weird. I know there's the humans and all this stuff, but how much more of that is there going to be? There's a lot. Of okay, great. So that's really cool. So I guess I'm just going to run around here. Um, Where are we at? Is this New Donk City? We are yet? in New Donk City. Okay. Um, and again, it is hard to talk about this game without spoiling all the fun things because it is just so good at... Well, spoiler free, you like it. Spoiler free. Spoiler free, we should play it. Yes. Absolutely. Okay. Um, it is one of the best Mario games of all time. That's what I want to hear. Um, so here's like the thing. Like, a lot of uh, people were saying that this is... Not people, Nintendo. We're saying that this is kind of the spiritual successor to uh, Mario 64 or yeah, yeah. Mario Sunshine. And it very much is, but it also feels like a successor to Galaxy. Okay. Uh, the, not all of the levels are giant and open world and kind of sandbox, do whatever the hell you want. Uh, I'm not doing anything particularly interesting. I'm just going to be running around. Um, there's a lot of levels that are more Galaxy-esque in terms of like, you'll like, like not this building, but like you go into a building and then it's like a little sub-level within it with its own obstacle to okay. get to the end of. Um, and I really enjoyed that because I feel like Galaxy was a big step forward uh, for the 3D Mario games, and like I was a little concerned about them going back to, to this style being a little too much. It's not too much. Okay. And I think that the core game, like the pacing is better than any other Mario game. Wow. There's very little filler. Okay. Um, there's a lot of stuff that you start doing, I'm like, all right, I don't know why. What's funny is, every single thing I said in the Let's Play about Mario Odyssey and the things that I didn't like about it, they all remain true. Okay. Like, when we had to do the stack up the Goombas to get to the Lady Goomba, I'm doing that way too much in this game. Okay. Uh, the cap taking over characters, I feel, is the weakest gimmick that Mario's had in the three So, like, games. Flood. So, Flood and Sunshine, the gravity in Galaxy. Okay. I think those were better implement, implemented and more fun than uh, capturing the enemies in this. Because a lot of it, it just does seem kind of like, all right, cool, uh, there's a big gap. I guess that whatever creature's right here is going to be the thing to take me over. Okay. Don't hop me. Get out of the road, Mario, do something! Um, but yeah, like I was saying, there's just so much imagination in this game, and I feel like that is kind of what they were totally going for. How long did it How long have you played, you think? Uh, probably 15 to 20. Okay. Oh, yeah, definitely, there was a lot in there. Look at him um, go! Look at him go. I, I never really changed my outfits. That's not what. It's not required. Yeah, fuck it. It's um, fun. I can't wait to do it. There are certain moons that you can only get in a certain outfit. Oh uh, yeah, in certain outfits gotcha. and or like certain places you can only get if you're like, like oh you you can't go here unless you look like you're ready to swim. Gotcha. Oh god. Yeah, oh god. Yeah. Hold on. Sorry. What are you doing, Mario? Um. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh god. Saved by the cat. They Saved say. Saved by that thing. All right. Cool. Um, I love this game, Greg. Okay. I love it so much. Uh, is it the Breath of the Wild of Mario? Yeah. No, it's not. No? No. It's it's what you'd expect Mario to be, and that's a great thing. Uh, it is quality from stem to stern. 
as they say. Yeah, they do say that. And, and like I was saying, the pacing of the game is just really great. I feel like there was never a moment where I was like, oh, I'm in this level too long. I feel like uh, even with Mario 64, uh, there was sometimes where I'm like, ah oh, man, like the first three challenges were good. Some of these other ones, I'm like, all right, I just want to get to the next thing. This keeps you moving, especially if you're just doing the uh, the only amount of moons you need to power the Odyssey to get okay. to the next thing. Okay. It keeps you moving to levels like bam, 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 bam. Um, I really like that they went through with the whole world aesthetic, um, and I thought that it was kind of half baked from looking at a lot of the trailers. Where I'm like, like okay, cool. Obviously, you have America here. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then obviously you had uh, some of the the other places where it's like, all right, cool. That's, Mexico. Yeah, in the Mexico and all that. But some of the other levels, I'm like, this just seems fairly generic. When you're in it, it's not. Like, okay. There's the the snow level is very um, Norwegian feeling, and like the, the characters that you interact with and stuff, it it makes all that shit make sense. Gotcha. Um, so I like that a lot. Oh, you stuck over this man. I did. You get this moon now. You ever oh, drive Lord. a car? No. This it's is like oh. Ooh. These controls are weird. It's like yeah, it's like the slot gear. car crap. I think. Is that what it was? Top, that's a show. That, but that, there was a, a game. There you go, there you go. There you go! Moon it up. There we go. You're racking up moons. Yeah. Um, so, really, and again, this is something I'm not even going to talk much about, is my favorite thing about the game is the post game. There's so much amazing stuff that happens, and going through it, this game's very easy, even for a Mario game. Okay. Uh, there was never a point that I was dying more than twice doing wow, okay. something. And it, and it kind of just to the point where I'm like, all right, cool, I, I know exactly what to do. So was it easy to the point of boredom or no? No, because the pacing was so good that it's just like, you you feel good just kind of going through knocking it. it you just keep okay. moving, knocking it out. And it, it, it does have the Breath of the Wild effect of, oh, what's that over there? I'm going to do that real quick okay. before I, I head back over here. Um, it's just, it doesn't feel as open as I feel like it kind of was marketed as. Okay. Um, but then again, it's like there's certain parts of the level that it's like, when I only did get the the bare minimum to get to the next set, like I missed out on a ton of shit. Mm, mm. So when I go back, oh god! Whoa, when I go Mario. back in to get more, like I, I'm looking forward to exploring every inch of the the areas. So these things are cool. That when you open it, it kind of opens up a sunshine style uh, bonus level, like the sunshine levels without flood. Okay. So like this is where like it's like the platforming. Yeah. yeah. Times. Bring it down on one side, run up to the Ooh. other, bring it down. Oh God! No! No way, Mario! All right, all right. I gotta be more nimble, nimbly quick. Mario's like a Pringle. He don't go soft. He's got a That's new true. jingle. It's about to go off. You gotta get lower. Oh, no, I should have backflipped. I should have backflipped. And now you're dead. And now you're dead. Well, that's the other thing. Uh, game overs are a thing of the past. Deaths. Inconsequential. Lives? No. no lives. You okay. have uh, your coins. Okay. You just have to get a bunch of coins. You can see that I have 618. Before yeah. 100, we get a one up. Nah. Now, every death costs, I think, 10 coins. Okay. So it's like, it's nothing. You know? And there's coins everywhere. And that's the other thing. This game, so many collectibles. Uh, and they're fun to get. Like, there's not too much that's like, oh, this is annoying and it's a chore. Like, okay. uh, the, the coin, the blue coins in Sunshine. Yeah. Uh, there, every level has unlimited normal coins. And then it also has uh, varying numbers of... Ooh, Mario! <laughs> uh, varying number, depending on how big the level is, of purple coins. And each each world has, a, each kingdom has a different, like... Currency? Little currency. Gotcha. Because uh, it's all around the world. And of it's course. Cute and shit. All around the world. Uh, oh my god, I love that, that song. song. ATC. Well, who did that? All around the world. Uh, yeah, the, those are all over the place. When you, those are fun to get. Those are the ones that you use to buy, like the, the super cool outfits. Hell yeah, that's what I want. I can't believe you're This will be my last many. attempt at this if I don't get it. My question for you. you uh, actually, I'll be quiet. You didn't think. Mario, setting it up the way he wants it to be. The rolling, oh, fuck. the roll. I the fucked roll. that up. I, I'll do it again. Do one more. Come on, you got this. You got this. How about nothing took more than two attempts? Oh, well, death. See, we're talking about death. Yeah, right. Almost a. All right, cool. Kev, calm down. Uh, I, was, I, said, I was trying don't. to be cute there. No, like, don't be cute. All right. The world's watching. Reggie is watching right now. I've also never played on a pro controller. Here comes I like this a lot. Yeah. This this is a real nice way to play this game. Because I've only been playing handheld because I was on a plane. I saw Ryan McCaffrey put up a photo over the weekend of his new puppy, uh, and he was like, my my co-op partner or whatever, and he had a, he had the pro controller in his hand. I'm like, I know what you're playing. Get up there, Mario! Oh! You got 
got a hold on this. You go, got, you, you gotta do this, and then run up. Get it nice and yeah, steep. But... Get it nice, and rock hard. You know, Kev. Yeah. Like you found oh, a Sears catalog and flipped to the underwear page. Rock hard. Hey. No, no, stay there. Yeah. All right. You need to wait, I but, but then it's gonna disappear. I don't have enough time to get over there. You have enough time just to land on the one. The key is rolling. I'm just not rolling right. Rolling rock. I fucking love Mario. Kev fucking loves Mario. I'm not sure if you can hear him. There. Oh my god. Jump, jump. I'm out. See, why didn't I get it there? I think it was. Dis I think it did disappear that time. All right. Fuck. You know what? Do one, do one, this one for your fucking pride. G is at home pride. watching. G I love to know. this game. Here we go. Uh, yeah, see, yeah. It's, the ding is it's, it's fading away. Like, you know. Now, how are you rolling? That's a new move, isn't it? Yeah. Sorry, so, I shouldn't ask so, you in the middle. But to roll, you you know how you long jump where you run and then ZL and then jump? No. Yeah. Like Mario 64. Okay, then yeah. Like, like this. Right? Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. It's that, but instead of jumping, you. It's. Uh, the. Throw the cap button. Okay, okay. And it's kind of hard to control, but then you. Hold on. Go fucking. Don't. You can, yeah, you don't can try do this, like, me. fun little. Oh, boost. neat, look at this. And you start going real You're fast. like a critter. Remember the movie Critters, kids? Mm -hmm. And when I say kids, I mean old people who grew up with the movie Critters. If, you're, if you are a kid looking for a good Halloween movie, Critters. Here we go. Oh, honey. Well, no, he showed me the roll for a while. Because I asked about it. It kind of looked like Rob Van Dam's Rolling Thunder, but I digress. Get your oh my ass God. out there. Christ. Tim, why don't you roll across the I street? I hate Cap. Don't, I know, I know. Don't let him get in your head. Can you roll off that? Ooh, that was good. That was good. God. Yeah, see, the roll is putting, giving me too much shit. I need to get up there and backflip. Backflip, huh? The backflip gets you enough air to get I'm, up there. I believe you. I'm not mad. I'm not judging. I'm just asking. That was perfect. Yeah! There we go. There we go. Fuck. That was, that was tight. That was tight in my chest for a while there. Now, great. Uh. Did, I, did I eat, like, 40 mystery Oreos today? I did, but all the same. Is that uh, a place you're going to buy stuff? Is that one on the top? No, it's not. It's some other shit. Uh, anyway, this game is freaking awesome, man. The music's super Can't cool. Can't wait to play. There's a couple really unique boss encounters, but there's a lot of boss encounters that I think are kind of lame. Uh, I think the majority of them, actually. Okay. Um, they feel kind of like just samey and me too over and over, and they're very easy to figure out when, when it comes to using your cat. Okay. And all that. These look like you can So is uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild still the best game on Switch? That's not, that's not how you spell no, Mario. I get it, I get it. Uh, uh, yes, it is. I think. I Again, I finally am getting to the point of this game where I'm just like, holy crap, this is amazing. Yeah. Because uh, the core game is great, but the real special shit comes afterwards. And uh, Breath of the Wild did shit for me where it changed Zelda for me, you know? Yeah. Now you see what you're doing wrong, right? Like, I bet the colors need to spell out Mario. Yeah, you're right. Not the you're other right. Way you're right. I, it's, yeah, I got you. I mean, I, maybe I'm wrong. There we go. Move that out. I really want to play this. But you see what I'm saying? Like, what we're doing right here? Yeah. There's a lot of this. There's a lot of okay. I know I get what it. to do now. I, I know exactly do it. what to yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. Oh come on! <laughs> Was that you laughing at him doing his thing? The animation. Yeah. It's beautiful. Like that, that walk. That's hilarious. Here we go. About to get it. Got about to get a moon. We got a moon over here. Andy, yeah. we're getting a moon over here. God. Not like Toys R Us. Not like Toys R Us. Okay. There you go. I don't know why it clicked in that time. Wahoo! This game looks amazing. Super Mario Odyssey. 
on the Nintendo Switch. Oh, it signs his name because it's a sign. Unless you're like watching like literally the moment we post it, available now. Available now? Yeah. No, fantastic game. I can't wait to put many, many more hours. Oh, here we go. This is going to be hard. 100? You can do it. Oh, no. Last time the can't. challenge, the first time I did this, I think it was only 20. Back up and give it another try. Did it take you a long time to get it? No, 20 was one try, but it got real fast. Oh, I see. Jumpman. Ah, see what he did there? Mario's original name, Jumpman. Yeah. Now, a lot of people don't know this. He has a brother named Luigi. When's the last time you jumped rope? Uh, Kevin, answer the question. When's the last time Tim jumped rope? Maybe when he was like 12. Maybe when he was 12, Kevin says. Holy crap. You got it. You got this. You got it by the balls. Uh, it is hard. That's real hard. Got the Wii Trainer whistle. I don't like it. Anyway, fuck it. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, this is Super Mario Odyssey on your Nintendo Switch. What do you think of it? Are you getting it? Are you getting them red Joy-Cons? Because I'm thinking about it. But I can't order them anymore. So I'm going to have to go to a real store. Kevin, you want to go to a real store Friday? Yeah. No, that's what I have to hear. You know you can scoot around in this game? I did not know that. Look at him. Look at Mario. What a cute Ooh. little man. He's the kind of man you just want to knock on top of the head and just keep with you forever. Good lord. You know what I mean? That is... Well, he's going to try to get away. We already know he can jump. He has all these adventures. We got to think... We got to build a prison able to keep Mario at bay. You understand what I'm saying, Kev? No. We need a prison for Mario. That's kidnapping. If you didn't know, ladies and gentlemen, you should subscribe to this channel, youtube.com slash kindoffunnygames. We put up the games cast, we put up Kind of Funny Games daily, we put up party modes, there's a whole bunch of cool stuff. Yeah, if you speaking like of it, games cast, we'll be doing a more in-depth review of okay. this, or at least I'll be giving more impressions of it. Okay, great. Uh, when I'm not playing tomorrow. Kevin and I are going to talk about Wolfenstein, no, Assassin's Creed. I'll talk about Wolfenstein, I'll talk about Life is Strange. Watch it live. If you support us on patreon.com slash kindoffunnygames at the dollar level. Watch it later on YouTube.com slash kind of funny games. You gonna try? You trying to get another moon here? I don't want to. You gonna kiss these fish ladies? Yeah, I'm just saying what's up to the mermaids. Yeah. I think this is. Uh, they are the. They are the precursors to the Inklings in Splatoon. They mate with Mario here. Make make uh make the Inklings. Squidlings, Inklings, what's that? Inklings. So Paul Dandy Cortez. This is what I'm talking about. These little purple coins. Yeah. New Donk City currency. Okay. And you can spend that on costumes? And so, you see, yeah, it's 53 out of 100. There's yeah. a big level, so there's 100. Some of okay. the levels only have 50. Okay. It's the whole thing. Some have more. I really want to play this game. Yeah, I can just play forever. Oh, you see that? Oh, Boom! Yeah. Hidden moon. Moon! There's moons everywhere, Greg. There's warren moons everywhere, too. See you next time. Subscribe, Bye. like, share.